Get you. Your doll has been up here doing mean and ugly things to people videotaping. <laughs> it was Melody. Paul Darla. It was John. It was John. He's John. Get the payback. Get him snoring. Get him snoring a little bit ago. <laughs> I don't hear him snoring. <laughs> There's Kim. There's Rita. Hey, There's Jeff. Who's up there? Ross and Tim. Marcia. Here's Stephanie. She's gonna hide. <laughs> and Devin. Kyle, you're all candy camera. <laughs> Rosenberg. Austria. So,
Coast. Pretty appropriate, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
child has a right to decide these days when they're young. A right to decide whether they... Uh, was, I heard it on the radio the other day, a child was allowed to make a decision on some very complicated thing. And they were going to accept the child's decision as whether to do it or not. Still waiting. Just a few more minutes before the embassy closes. Are you talking to yourself? Oh, we talked about She has... I'm glad you got this all on tape in case I ever forgot it. Like you could even do that. The embassy, we got, got pictures and the guy wanted more money than we had in Hungarian, so he's, we said, will you take dollars or Deutschmarks? He said, no, you had to go to the train station. So Kathy and I were off again and we ran down to the train station and were able to get the money changed. Ran back, got the photos and made it back to the embassy and processed it with three minutes to spare. So I appreciate the prayers. Billy, <laughs> this Christy. They're sharing. Everybody wave to the camera. Oh, that'd be nice. <laughs> A flea market, yeah. We'll be going over across the river to eat. <laughs> How about the knees and Kathy? Hi. <laughs> Aileen and Lisa. And there's Kathy. <laughs> That's what we were, went last year. Brother Jimmy? Exchange money. Nice things. People are buying. Such pretty bright colors. This is Iris.
Alive and well, we're so glad. We're here at the Stop Bistro, <laughs> somewhere in Hungary. He's going way over there. I think they're really wide circle. He's over on the right now. I think he's probably going for a landing. So keep an eye out for them. We have seen some storks flying in the air. There's one up here on the left. Up here on the left. Right up here on the left. Right up here, Cam. Look, and they're all out. Perfect, Cam. Another one to the left. Put a stork on it. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. The Romanians are very gracious people. Uh, be careful not to flaunt your wealth. Uh, don't don't embarrass them by giving them uh, too much in the way of gifts, and do not uh, uh, gush about their their belongings or the handmade uh, doilies they've got or something like that. If, if you express too much interest or in something, you're going to end up taking it home with you. And uh, we don't want to abuse the, the privilege of, uh, uh, of their hospitality. Yeah, be careful anytime you get off the bus, around the sport hall, at the hotel, anywhere. Uh, you're going to run into gypsy beggar kids uh, and adults as well. The, the admonition is not to give them anything, okay? You're going to be tempted to hand them a piece, piece of gum or some candy or something like that. The, the Romanians urge us not to do that because it only reinforces the begging that they're doing. Uh, the church does have programs and resources to help them. Uh, matter of fact, they taught us a phrase last year that was Meshets la Biserica, which says, means go to the church. Meshets la Biserica. Okay? Yeah, it's going to be a hard time. Hard time. If you tell them go to the church, then maybe they'll understand. But the uh, admonition is to watch yourself. Okay, that'll that'll pretty much cover what you need. Uh, if you if you want to find a toilet, that's not too bad. Toiletta. I see the lineup of trucks to our right that are all waiting. See, she can't see the guards. The guards are in front of us. Very careful. Very careful. Very careful. Very careful. We're being very nonchalant with this kid. And um, the, the longer they're married, Inside the, the more Joe and I can see how old she's getting. Her hair is graying faster. Doug was telling us earlier that and he found um, out the hard way not to be uh, videotaping uh, here. Uh oh, she's had heart problems. It was. Go ahead and sit over there. No, I'm stopping. Okay. 
celebration of his victory over death and the coming of his kingdom. A kingdom not made with hands, but formed by the Spirit in the hearts of men.
him at the spot. By the microphone. Right there. Yeah. He'll be right there. And uh, he's going to be... Can I be the blind man too? <laughs> oh, you look so cute, Steve. Are you going to yell? Are you yell? Can I yell? Do you yell? Oh, well, yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs>
just play it or let me just sing it? Sing it. Well, do you want Bibles and tracts off the truck to uh, take them into town. Thank you. 
I'm the opposite of the big more handful. I know. I want to get Bible. Okay, Zeta? Okay. Okay. Here we are at the market, open air market. Flowers, food, vegetables.
We invite you to come and experience a big Eastern musical drama. It is very beautiful, something you will never forget. We invite you to come and join thousands of others tonight. We will be singing and presenting a play about Jesus. We invite you tonight. Good morning. I greet you on behalf of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We have come here this morning to tell you how you can gain eternal life for our Lord and Savior. Each of us has turned to his own way. Ten years ago, I was struggling with something. Ten years ago, I was looking. I was searching. I didn't know what I was looking for. I found God's Word. I found Jesus Christ in my life. Isaiah also tells us that the Lord has caused the enemy of us all to fall upon Him. The sins that I've committed and the, and the wrongs that I have committed, that I have done, Jesus Christ has bore them. 2,000 years ago, Jesus Christ was nailed to the cross. While on the cross, Jesus looked up at God and asked, Why have you forgotten me? God had to look away from Jesus. The reason being because Jesus had my sins. And Jesus Christ had your sins on you. He tells us that yet he himself, being Jesus Christ, for the sin of many, and interceded for the transgressors. He also tells us that Jesus will justify the many. My dear friends, I have come here for one purpose. To give you an opportunity to accept the eternal gift. The gift of salvation. Because I want to spend eternity with you. We want to gather around God's throne. If you do not know Jesus Christ, you will have an opportunity to know him. And I guarantee he will change your life. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, you were lifted up on the cross, and you died for my sins, and you died for the sins of the many here. I just ask that your Holy Spirit will come now and touch hearts, God. Lord Jesus, I pray that your name will be lifted up. I pray, dear God, the ones who do not know you, 
cei care nu te cunosc, să vină la tine într-un har mulțitor. Pentru că acesta nu merg cu
been done since we were last here. Today is the 24th of April, 1993. Here's the other side, looking in. Side now. Well, and all these are going to be stained glass windows here. Fire walking across the street from the old church. There they all are. Education win. And uh, we're going in now. So let's go. Right. Last year they were just pour, poured this round thing here. The baptistry. Looks like the choir lines up here. Wow, look at this. Like the feet as we do. The choir.
Afterward, there was the revolution, and we wanted to build a church. We had another land somewhere, not so much as here. And somebody came and said, what uh, if we will build on this land? I said, it's impossible. Uh, so with about uh, 10,000 marks, Deutsche Marks, we bought everything here. <laughs> And we started to the build, and everyone <laughs> said, you must be crazy. <laughs> because the architect said to us, I worked about 25 years uh, doing something which I did not like. Now I want to build a church which will remain for uh, years and years. So he said, don't tell me to do something I, I won't like. And so he uh, was uh, with the project of this building. It's a huge building. Maybe some uh, of you can say it's uh, too expensive for our empty pockets, but we trust God. This is the largest Baptist church in Europe. You know. And the people in the city, which is very interesting to, to know, they said, we will come when this church will be ready. Because they don't have, you will uh, see tomorrow morning, they don't have any space in our church on Sunday. So, by God's grace, I am uh, an optimist. Uh, we will have here many, many baptismal from the uh, people which do not belong to the Baptist family. They will come here, and step by step, the revival you felt and you will feel will spread to whole Europe. Amen. And I, I think that even the ocean won't be able to stop the revival to go over the ocean. Amen. Somewhere in America. Amen. Ah, don't misunderstand me. We are praying for this. Because the future of the world is a spiritual one. The people are very, very, you see, sure about this. Fortunately, we have many friends in the States. Fortunately, we have many friends which live uh, in West Germany. And fortunately, we have a uh, wealthy father. He has all the cattle of the hills. Amen. But you know, as a gypsy said sometime to my father, he said, uh, Lazarus was the name of my father. You know, I have a big amount of money in heaven. But you know what is the trouble? God is giving them to me only in small amounts. <laughs> And so, this church was for us a testing uh, place. God did not uh, allow us to remain without money. Because we are in a terrible economic depression or crisis. But I am so sure that next e Easter... Cla high school classrooms. And on this side was... Um a hotel for their visitors for the church and also for um, offices. This area right here is where they're going to build it, the seminary. Off to the right. Here where this foundation is being yep, laid? Yep, and all that area back there that's been cleared out. Yeah. 
Consider a couple of other options of things, but uh, okay. uh, we'll see as we go along, all right? I would like to go see that orphanage over there, right. but we have not we have not let them know, and we, we must make arrangements with them in order to be able to, to go there, all right? So if we can work it out, we will, but uh, I, I'm not for sure. I know you'd love to go there. I would, too. Uh, you can take a look at the pig. Some of our guys are playing with some of theirs. They seem pretty serious about their game. There's Devin. Kathy. Lala. The dog has been here several times, so she knows a lot of people. There's Kim. There's Rita. Who come in is Maja. Tammy picking up Tina's face. Tina is our interpreter this year. She's doing a wonderful job. <laughs> Well, she turned around, but this is Denise. This is Kathy getting the coat. We all look the same from the back. <laughs> this is Lisa. This is Lisa. Daryl and Talker. Well, this is Friday. No, this is Iris. And there's Jenny. Hi, Jenny. Millie. Here's Donna. Martha. Martha must be singing tonight. Yes. There's what? Teresa. Surprise. <laughs> She's dressed. <laughs> Here's Christy. When you're in San Antonio, you get her hair all fixed up. Doesn't she look beautiful? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is Eileen. The other one's Eileen. Because Eileen means. <laughs> She Get the cross set up. Oh. This is Paul Harden. And here's Mark, he's already made up. <laughs> here's one of our guards. Hello. <laughs> Here is, here's the Don And Mary. I mean, um. Yes. And Mary. What is her name? This is still dressed, but he is. I'll, be, I'll leave. <laughs> Oh, we might have to film you. Who can he be? Yes, who can he be? <laughs> who can he be? Who he is? <laughs> and here's Ron. He's our sub. He's our I'm backup. Yeah, guy. he's our backup guy. There's so Gene. Oh, there. <laughs> Good. A drink. Egyptian. No, um, <laughs> drink. Thank you very much. Take two. Oh. <laughs> this is Carla. And this is Stephanie. Stephanie is our official makeup person. Yes, makeup artist. She a, does a very good job every night. Now, is Tammy planning to come in with the blood on her? We hope so. 
you look oh, she white here? last Chris, night. She's here. She's here. Do you want to start doing it? Chris. Would you try to locate her? She showed me that. Oh, yeah, she was down there in our room. You can start it if you want to. Yeah. Is this one far? We've been working on... Uh, on James, and now you put me on the spot, and I don't know if I can produce it. With the pink sweater. Many have stood an hour and a half. I'm going to have sat for a couple of hours. I don't know if it's two hours now. I'm going to try to walk around this route, believe it or not. And I'm calling out the name for the American.
Yes, all these men and women. There's Adrian, there's Maddie, there's Joe, there's Yeah, that's a rich deal. 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 Yeah, that's a r
Getting out water. There's the flock tender. Hello, flock tender. Hi. Water. Anyone from water? <laughs> see, uh, Jim just told me that behind that sign is that guard tower. I, I see it now, and it looks like a guard on it, by golly. What? He has binoculars. Oh, no. <laughs> it's a machine gun. <laughs> Here we go. Bye bye, Gordon. Hi, Romania. It's actually 847. This was written by a six-year-old. Who hasn't been to school yet? <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Oh, Jerry. Jerry did something good. I just need to get your mind Yeah, yeah, they're weird always. 
go grab it now. You want to uh, come be the middle person so I don't go to the car? Come off? No. Just hop him. There you go. Look at the glass, I think it says. We're going to put this portable. Yeah, we can't manage that here. we got to put these up in the back inside, don't we? i tell you what, we, if there's a portable, we can start bagging. We just want the stuff left out here. Or are you taking it inside? Uh, treat this kindly. I think it might be. The worst one was the Romanian one, and we left shortly after you guys did. Well, I guess this wraps up the trip. Uh, Hungary to Austria, 10 minutes. Is this ours? Uh, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.